Okay, this vlog's gonna be in two parts. One vlog, but I'm gonna have have it in two parts. Um, uh, the first part of this vlog is going to detail Zoom's neuter um, and how that's gone. Um, and then the other part is going to cover our training session we just did. Um, so in the next part I pop up is probably gonna be on um, see how things go with Emily when she comes on Wednesday. So um, his neuter went about as well as I expected. Um, and um, he was done for with surgery within an hour, which for a neuter is pretty typical. They're very fast. Um, so um, the vet's like, this is went well. His incision's a little bigger just because, um, and I mentioned this in my, uh, the vlog previous. But anyway, um, that went very well. He was at the vet an extra day just to give him more time to recover. Um, I am essentially just putting a collar, a recovery collar on him at night because I don't want him messing with his uh, incision. Um, and for the most part, he's been pretty good with li leaving it alone. I don't think he's in pain anymore because he's like, um, I still don't want him bouncing around, um, which I've been, um, been pretty um, careful with that, which he was kind of nuts uh, yesterday, which didn't really help me. It's like he had so much pent up energy. Um, he, he, between yesterday and, uh, last night and this morning, he was like completely unmanageable. Um, but really focusing his energy has re really helps. And, um, so that seems to have um, fixed most of the problem and I was able to take him for a walk today so that was good and I was walking him a little bit after he came home it was just a little harder to do that um, to do that and um, just when he was a little bit more out of it and he had all this medication on board um, I am actually very glad I am not giving him medication anymore because it's been a massive headache. Um, he, the, his pain meds are chewable and he'll take that fine. He has, he has to take like a half of that. And, but the tranquilizer the vet gave me is not a chewable and I spent two days shoving them down his throat, which took me about half an hour and I am short on sleep because I have had the last three nights. I've either been up um, letting him out or I have been up late trying to get meds into him. Neither of which I'm going to try to do tonight. And hopefully he settles down and he actually sleeps today. So, um, but I think I kind of headed off his energy because I had to make him think today which um brings me to the next part of this vlog which I will cover in a minute so I just did a training session with him like within the past half hour or so and um he actually did way better than I expected I had asked Emily before his neuter um and when she brought him back what you want me to work on and she's like just um reward him for picking things up or putting his mouth on things which is how you teach a retrieve anyway even if they put their mouth on it and don't pick it up and give it back to you um um give it back to you you'd still reward them the thing about Zoom is you can tell when his brain's working on something and he knows what you want. I can watch his brain working and I can watch him figure, trying to figure something out and he knows what I want. And he knows I can't reach things. He's known this for months. Um, he knows I can't reach certain things. 
Um, and he's already very interested. If I have something in my hand um, that I am going to, he knows I'm going to be working with. Um, but I actually had tried doing a pickup, a retrieve with my wallet uh, before his neuter, and he didn't get it. He got it today. I had him, He the first time he tried it, he dropped it. The second time he tried it, he picked it up. The third time he tried it, he picked it up and gave it back to me. And he's figured, he figured it out in five minutes. He, he's figured this out in maybe 10 minutes. I had to correct him for running off with the deodorant. Um, it was interesting because I actually had, I just had stuff shoved down the side of my chair. And I had actually dropped the deodorant on accident, not on purpose, like I was doing to teach him how to do a, a just a drop retrieve, which is you drop something, the dog picks it up. And um, I prefer, that's more of what I'm focusing on. Emily is teaching both that and a distance retrieve. I can't do a distance retrieve work with him because of I don't want him running. So, um, but what I did today was I inadvertently dropped my deodorant. I got him to pick it up and he was running into his crate and I corrected and I said no. And he brought it right back and gave it to me. He will give me things. Um, and I now need to transfer this to about everything I drop um, if I can get him to do it. Um, but again, He's only, he's a year and, he's a year and about a month, almost two, a year and two months. And um, so he's not even 15 months yet. Um, so um, he did really well today. And I don't know if I mentioned this in my previous vlog, but when I am doing retrieve work with him, I have learned that I have to do it when he's focused. If I'm not, do, if I can't, if I try to work, um, if I try to work him when he's not focused, he doesn't work. He's, he's, he's distracted. I mean, and he was a little distracted, but he wasn't as distracted as he has been. Um, but what I've been doing is when I get the treats out of the fridge, which I use for a reward as like, or when I put on his vest, it's okay, Zoom, time to go to work. And, um, he knows what that means. And, um, so that's what I've been doing when I've been working with him. And that's worked very well. And I can't wait to tell and show Emily what he will do. I don't know if he'll do it with her there because he'll be distracted by her and she'll have food and all that and he'll be distracted by that. But he is working on it. He will pick it up, pick up and pick up items. Um and so I will show um so I will do that with um I'll show her that when I see her on uh, on Wednesday. And um, so I'm actually really happy with how things are going. Um, he's recovering from his neuter well. He's obviously feeling way better um, because he actually has a lot of energy right now. I mean, the, th the biggest issue is not letting him run and not letting him jump. I can't send him on a full retrieve yet because I don't want to zip his incision. Um, if he, um, if his surgical site is still looking kind of red, which it was today, the swelling has gone down, but if he's still looking kind of irritated, I may give him a pain pill um, a little bit later. I might actually give it to him before bed so he like chills out um, and give it, to him with his dinner because he's he's just so um I need him to kind of veg out and I am like out of peanut butter so I might actually put cheese on his bone tonight so um so he so I can get him to wind down um so I actually get some sleep tonight um because I am very short on sleep and um I got a decent sleep after 
I took him out the second time, but I'm still short on sleep thanks to one late night, like four late nights in a row. So four, three or four late nights in a row. So um, yeah, I'm really happy with that. And um, the next few things I will probably um, work on is um, I'm going to do a Starbucks run. I am going to take him to church for my prayer appointment, which is on Thursday. Um, that's the plan right now. Um, and based on how he is acting today, I would say I would be able to take him because he's fine. Um, I think if um, he's still being kind of antsy, I will. Um, but anyway. So, I the plan is to take him to church uh, on Thursday for my prayer appointment, which is an hour. I want to introduce him to the prayer team because he has an answered prayer that everybody was praying about. And so, I will pick you guys up with that and with the other um, public access runs that I'm going to be planning on doing with him and how his retrieve training is going and with his um, object pickup. Um, had I been thinking I would have filmed it, I think I might film some of our lesson on um, Wednesday if I think of it. Um, so I will do that. And I will see you guys um, either in the next clip or in the next video, whatever comes first. Thank you.